It's the Daily Talk Show, episode 584. What's happening, guys? we got the boys from the Inspired Unemployed Thank in the building. Cheers. Matt Thanks and Jack. Us. Thanks for having us. Mate, boys, welcome to the Daily Talk Show studio. Hey, feels good. Have, it's you bloody been, pleasure. have you been to Melbourne before? See, this no. is funny. Like, we never have. We never have. That's, That's funny, right. isn't it? <laughs> so everyone, like, <laughs> everyone lines, that's super funny because we're 24, lived in Australia our whole lives, and both of us have never been to Melbourne. It's like the only two people we know yeah. that haven't been to Melbourne. But in fairness, what's the closest now. airport to you boys? Sydney. Sydney. Which is a couple of hours away. <laughs> yeah, do so it. It's yeah. A, it's I mean, a, that's no excuse. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. A, no excuse. a massive mission for a session in Melbourne yeah, yeah, for a weekend. Mm. You, you know, you feel like you, we've been travelling around for five years around the world. You feel like... You just need to get away from Australia. So we yeah. just don't ever need to yeah. go to Melbourne. But I feel now like we're here. everyone in Australia has been to Melbourne except for us, but now right. we can say we have, so it's um, all good. I've uh, spent a bit of time with you boys in my bed. My wife My wife loves to sit in bed watching your content on Instagram. Oh, God. That's where I first came into contact first with came. it. <laughs> <laughs> I really did set it up, didn't I? Yeah. Um, but it's been a happy ending. It's, uh, yeah. it a, no, but I saw you, uh, mm. a mutual friend, someone you, you've spent some time with in Melbourne, PK. PK. Posted a video with you guys. Paul and Kelly. I just jumped in, mm. mate, i got to get these guys on the show and next minute you're here. Mm-hmm. So I really appreciate yeah. the uh, PK. Great mutual friends. Uh, if, you, if you look back, you only started posting on Instagram Feb last year. Mm. Mm. Almost our anniversary, isn't it? Mm. One year. That yeah. isn't some kind of uh, archive the last seven <laughs> years that we're seeing? Or you no. just, it literally started it's posting? Li- literally. Yeah. Seven, yeah, a year ago. Yeah. yeah. Like 11 months. Yeah. Been going for. Well, Crazy. I, I think when someone probably looks at your content, because I, I, hadn't, I hadn't looked at the date on the first post. Mm-hmm. They, they might just think you're, you know, you guys are tradies yeah, yeah. that have just found your fucking calling in yeah. video content. <laughs> mm. And so I haven't dug too deep into that story because I like that story yeah. in my head. Well, that's our story too. Just a couple of tradies. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, I tell you. What's, what's your background, yeah. boys? <laughs> video production. Feel my like feel, do you think my hands are soft? By the way, very nice. No, they're like the softest hands. Feel, they are. They're, they're office hands. <laughs> yeah. For sure. Yeah. And so, were you guys actually tradies before you got into video content? The most they, hard. Yes. Yeah. No, Sorry, he has the most. It. He's got plastic hands. Yeah, yeah like there, plastic. there's some serious. Like that's not good for my softness. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like you're, yeah. I'm actually yeah. sandpaper. They call me. That's yeah. a loofah for his yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Now we have. No, I've been a tradie for about nine years, which is crazy. I've been one for about three years. What trades? Is that a dumb question? Is no, that what no. you're saying? No, that's, that's right, yeah. <laughs> no, it's not I was doing carpentry and... Plastering. Yep. Plastering, uh-huh. yeah. But well, I was only home for a few months a year for the last six years or so. So not a whole lot, but still done the apprenticeship and... Yeah. Jazz. yeah. And but, so what were you doing? Tra- you were travelling? Yeah, like snow. I was snowboarding for about five years, like seriously, trying to just chase seasons around. But yeah. then come home for a few months a year to get some money and then... Do a bit over Canada and stuff. As so well. yes, yeah, so you do it all again. Yeah, that's yeah. fun. Um, and so you are you guys still tradies? Or are you working, or you've have you fully transitioned into uh, Instagram life? <laughs> well, yeah, it's good life. Um, well, we're not really working for the next couple yeah. of months. I don't pr- think. Pretty much, it's the transition now. Yeah. About six weeks ago, we qu- we quit. Hopefully, yeah. don't have to go back, but we'll see how yeah. it goes. You went out, went out with the, blew the building before yeah. you walked out. Yeah. Catch yeah. oh. yeah. We're out of here. My dad's my boss. So you made he's it. probably listening to this in an hour and just going, my fucking dickhead son <laughs> <laughs> left me. Well, you, would you be uh, begging him for a job back yeah. in a couple of months when this all this shit? Yeah. Do you get a, a pushback from guys on the work site when they see you pulling out the phone? Oh. Well, we don't really pull Try it not out. to. We don't really do it when nah. I'm at work. Usually after we don't pull out at work. Videos and shit. <laughs> yeah. But like, yeah, I mean, it's pretty funny. Like we do like a video and like just everyone watching it the next day, you're just cringing on fuck. Oh. Everyone on the job site's like watching it. And yeah, like, yeah. Oh, you, pro- you try to post the most cringe videos on a Friday. So then you <laughs> day, you're not at work just going, oh my God, who's seen it? Who saw it? Yeah, fucking yeah. hell. Kill me. Did you guys do like uh, drama or theatre or anything like that no. in school? No. You get asked that a lot actually. No, and and never, never, no. not a thing. I was petrified, like, yeah, did go, sure. oh. Like, we, like, three years ago, we lived in, I was it three or four years, we lived in, um, we moved over to New Zealand and lived in Queensland for, like, six months, and that's where we started doing the videos. This, this was mm. ages ago on a different mm. page we did. It was, like, Pine Tree TV, mm. a group of us did it, and um, it kind of blew up back home, like, a little bit, like, nothing like this, like. Yeah, get 40, 50 comments and. 
People love it back home. Hey? Like, yeah, yeah. Proper. And, and then so we, back home being... Cool, am I like Kiama. Sound Ghost? So we're in New Zealand doing it and back home, like, yeah, around yeah. home. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Kiama and stuff. So your family are loving your views. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Honestly, Mom, dad, auntie, mm-hmm. uncle. Yeah, my mum's one of yeah. 12 and my dad's <laughs> one of nine. So it's pretty much only our family. His like mum is the biggest fan ever. Mm. She she calls him up, like, after something good happens and just goes, ah! yeah. Oh, my oh God. My, I'm crying. Yeah, today, <laughs> we were on the Today Show today and um, she messaged me. She's like, I'm crying. <laughs> like, oh, I've literally heard so her, like, good. Not on speaker, and I can hear her go. Ah! <laughs> so Loves funny. It. Fuck, so I so funny. appreciate that more than the person that's been pushing to be on yeah. telly and be the uh, presenter yeah. for many years. Yeah. Which was me early days. I used to, want, you know, like, and and it never really happens to those people. It's the people that don't see it as the thing that they probably were destined to do mm. from mm. 20, 15 years ago. And then you find your rhythm, you yeah. see that it's actually gaining traction. Yeah. I mean, people say you can't build an Instagram following these days, you know, because it's it's too hard. Yeah, but they, they suck at content. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys are the content first approach. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. like not the influencer esque yeah, style. Yeah. When did the uh, yeah, Insta? Yeah. When did the Instagram pop? <laughs> um, oh, like only a couple of months ago, really. Yeah. We we're doing it for a long time. It was a slow grind. Yeah, at the start. so it's like seven months. September to get is kind of when it started to like, like snowball, like roll. Yeah, took us we were, took us seven months to get to ten k. Felt like bloody seven years. Yeah, but um, yeah. Then after that, a couple of videos just spiraled and went out of control. Mm-hmm. Got like yeah. 25,000 followers in like 24 hours on one of them. It was nuts. How does the concepts come about? Do you have, like talk through that? Ooh. Like just. It is pop. Just sometimes pop, it just yeah. pop into your head. Just or have been doing it that long now. It just is kind of capture natural. them? Do you write them in your notes yeah. and yeah. then yeah. hold on to them? Yeah. Yeah. Relatable Stuff content like is the best. Yeah. For yeah. Us. Exactly. Like even something you do like. Like. like do you know. I don't know if you've seen the rolling cam one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Just, yeah. It actually happened. I was like, <laughs> putting the tra- like rubbish out, and then the can like dropped and rolled. And then I was just seriously chasing it down the driveway. And I was like, oh, that's an yeah, idea. Yeah, so, yeah. And yeah. so you then put it on a string and, and it, you follow the chase yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. through the, the neighborhood. The worst like, production yeah. of a video. Yeah, but that yeah. adds to it, right? You don't need yeah. it to be high production. Yeah. Um, the thing that happens with plastic bags too. They're the f- mm. they, when they get oh. caught in the wind, you just mm. how is that? Because you can't be a gronk and just I let know, it go. No, you just look the other way. Yeah, yeah. You gotta oh. chase that bastard. Yeah, <laughs> that, was, that time, gives yeah. you a good chase. That's cross country chasing one another. Oh, it's always it's always the time when it's like a hot girl across the street watching you, and you're just chasing this fucking <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Bit, bit of rubbish, just going, please stop, please stop, and, and it just keeps going. You get like one like centimeter away from it, and yeah. just <laughs> again, you're like, ah! trip over. So you're looking for relatable things. I saw yeah. like where you you had. Sk- Scomo, you didn't have him on. Scomo. You had the, he was on the show. Some, yeah, someone Scomo. pretending to be Scomo and the, yeah. the joke being about the handshake oh. and him chasing you guys down for the handshake, which is Josh and I had handshake banter about yeah. Scomo, which is you're just finding those moments. Yeah, mm. yeah pretty much. Just relate to relate mm. or just stupid. Like, mm. And then just write him down, get together and then talk about him like this is going to be shit or this is going to be good. How can we make it good, I guess? Yeah. And just go That's from fair. there. Yeah. I don't know. It kind of comes natural. Most comedians have either like an airport or plane joke around related, because like, obviously it's a very relatable thing. It feels like yeah. when you're on a plane or you're in transit, ideas right. come. Do you find it coming to Melbourne, being on the on the flight at the airport, <laughs> were, you, were your notes? Yeah, did we? No, we're really. too, uh, to did be we honest, we're like, too in shock of, we're going to for work. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 And we're hungover, we're so that so didn't hung over. Yeah. I think I slept the night before, to be honest. And but, yeah. Yeah, it something, but that does happen. Like, it does, yeah, always. Definitely. When you're in the right mindset, not. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah, like that, like I, ooh, a couple of weeks ago, I was in the car with someone, still got to do this video. I probably shouldn't even say this, but anyway, <laughs> sitting in the car and you know when like someone's sitting next to you and trying to put the seatbelt in and like kind of like touching your ass, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. like, and you kind of don't, you know, but you kind of don't, and it just gets real awkward. Yeah. And I was like, oh, that's yeah. an idea. So I got to do that. <laughs> and so you build out sort of a book of these ideas where you could. Are, are you actually then scheduling time in the week now to go Monday and Friday we film, or is it just yeah. sporadic? Try no, to. try to for sure. It's just, now we do. It doesn't sound like this. You guys would probably know, but it doesn't sound like there's much to it. But it's like. We're struggling to. F- I swear we work until like ten o'clock at night, mm. not all hours of the day. But yeah, it's a lot more work goes into it than what people think. I mm. 
I assume. Is that from the very beginning you were putting that much effort into videos? So, yeah, we started and we did a couple and like started the page and we're like, let's actually try and give this a crack and make someone of it. Mm. And then listen to like, like Gary V. Tony, and like Robbins Tony Robbins and Gary That were and our then, idols. Though. And then Gary V, much like what you guys are trying to do, like a podcast today, we're like, mm. let's try and put out a video day yeah. for like so long because that's what Gary V's like. content, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So then we just, yeah, tried to pump out as many videos while when we were over in um, France, we were in this shit Airbnb and we we're just like, let's oh. just punch out as many videos as we can mm. and we're just enjoying it and having fun yeah. because it was, yeah it was exciting and new and then yeah i mm. guess we're just trying to pump out as much as yeah. we could and then just consistent with good content that's what we're trying to do and we had time on our hands so we're like we love it let's go let's try and just do it and we'll, honestly it. we honestly went for a holiday holiday to europe and i swear we're like working we're, we're writing like scripts and then filming trying to put up like four videos a week it's mm-hmm. taking up so much time mm. still had a good time but was but, it the um, traveling bit, like being somewhere else instead of, uh, it opens your mind up yeah, a bit when you're yeah. overseas, right? And it's so easy and to shame yourself because like, you know, you <laughs> go home and like see people in the street after yeah. you've like done, I don't yeah. know, dressed up as a girl or anything. Like, yeah. And we're like, if we got to, because that first stage is the hardest where you're trying to get to, a, where people are actually like, okay, this is all right. Yeah. That, but like we were shaming it. I remember some of the ones we've done with, oh God cringing mm. like, so do you have a sense of uh that it could become a business or at what point were you like oh we can actually monetize i think oh, it's so <clears> hard <throat> because we, the whole time we we had a vision for it we'd always have like little goals to get here and there definitely wouldn't we would never be like by christmas we would have 100k followers and mm-hmm. be doing what we're doing yeah exactly but at all with no way We've so made, what did the goals when look it, like when it came oh sorry no. Well, yeah, where did the goals, like, what did uh, they look like? Well, just like, we, the end goal kind of, we wanted to try and make, a do this, yeah, and so hopefully, like, it opened doors to try yeah. and make it a career some, yeah. in some way or another. Like, didn't know really know what the exact end goal was, but we knew if we did well, yeah. it'd open up doors, whatever it be. I don't yeah, know, we, it was acting. like a resume. Yeah. We were looking at it as like a resume for any entertainment kind of yeah. work, I guess. Even like if we could filming jobs or we didn't really know exactly what but we knew we wanted to kind of be in this kind of yeah industry i guess maybe. yeah 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 no, and then yeah, for sure when we started it started to blow up a little bit like got over to like 15 or twenty thousand followers or whatever started getting emails from management saying we want to manage you guys like oh, whatever yeah like was brains. it a tipping point was there a clear <clears throat> tipping point where yeah there was for sure mm. what was it was it a specific piece of content it was yeah. it would have been that Oh, it was a f- actually no, it was a few. It was like three. It was like that Britney Spears one. Then <laughs> yeah, that was a f- yeah. The whole notes like dancing down the street, and then that dance one where we're like pretend we're in Berlin. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it's seen like it. be my lover. Have you yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Rolling like black sus costumes. Yeah. <laughs> that was a tipping point for sure. Yeah, that that those three kind of like made the whole ball start rolling, and then yeah, probably on that third one where we're dancing around in like black, yeah. in Berlin kind of gear. That's when we started getting a lot of mm. like brands like wanted to work with us yeah, and that's because that's when we went from like i think we're on, we got went from 10 9k to like 25 overnight and we're just like what is going on and what are the what, what's the emails what are, what are they saying to you oh they, yes it's, it's lots of brands that want to collab and do so st- like you'd make obviously make a video yeah for festivals yeah for them like you do on your page but we knock a lot of them back knock, just because yeah. we don't want to be mm-hmm. yeah we don't really want to like flood our page yeah. with that kind of stuff. Yeah. In a year's time, no one will like us. <laughs> we just sold it <laughs> yeah. out. Fucking losers. But, but I think, yeah, we're just trying to do the stuff that fits us. Yeah. Well, for yeah. sure. What did you watch growing up? <sighs> oh. What did, I don't know. Ha- Hamish and Andy have been influencers for sure. Yeah. For us. Um, seeing that they've been on the show. Yeah. How yeah, was that? Times. Yeah, great. Yeah, awesome. They're funny, funny they're, guys. They're inspiring. <laughs> but they are in, they're employed. Yeah, 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 they're employed. employed. Yeah. Shit. We'll have to change our name when hopefully we get employed one day. Yeah. No, uh, I don't know. Seriously, I don't. We don't really get inspiration from. Nah, don't really. Like, watch. Like, everyone asks, like, do you watch other skit like pages and stuff? And I, I don't at all. Like, no. I don't really watch. I don't know. Just nah. Seriously, nah. Not, not really. Mm. At all. I guess that's kind of why our styles like it is. Maybe. How old are you, boys? Um, I'm 18 and Matt's 17. 
We're going to get this child to sign a relationship. Where's your mum? Yeah, yeah. No, I'm 25, 24. Okay, 25. And so you guys grew up on the. With, you know, with Facebook and <laughs> that, yeah, that yeah. generation. On the yeah. Facebook. On the Facebook. Yeah. 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 MySpace. Bit of MySpace back Did you have MySpace? Were you, were you on MySpace? Yeah. yeah. For a couple yeah, well, of years? Yeah, well, I was on MySpace yeah, for a while. Yeah, for sure, year seven. Were you on MySpace? Yeah. yeah. Prime years? Well, that was f- before the Facebook dropped. Yeah. <laughs> no, <laughs> the Facebook. Yeah. Before, actually, it was the, <laughs> the Facebook, Facebook, wasn't it? Early, 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 early days. Yeah. Early days. 2008, I think I got on Facebook. Yeah, so that was, that's fairly yeah, late. Yeah. Is it? It was four years. Oh, four years. Yeah. I think it was, I think it was oh, early 08. Yeah. Um, a lot of people in Australia were getting on. Yeah. 07 mm. was super early. I was, I was 08 as well. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> well, I mean, that kind of guides us in terms of the content we're watching. I mean, growing up with telly, mm. were you, were, did you watch much TV? I loved um, Thank God You're Here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was such a good show. Timeless show. Time, still, yeah. still so fucking funny. Awesome. Oh, my God. And what, what else? No, I, don't, I, I never re- really watched no. too much TV, to be yeah, honest. We don't even have a TV. Even movies I'm pretty bad with. Yeah, I don't watch movies. Oh, well, Josh and I talk about like the um, naivety when you first start making videos that is is so productive, like when yeah. you don't really understand all the elements of making video so there's less boundaries mm. in place. Uh, you know, so you, you go into an idea and give it a fucking red hot crack. Mm. Is there stuff that you guys started after making a bunch of like, oh, we probably should, you know, like it's a barriers come up and you're yeah. like, nah, it's too much. Can't be bothered. Or, you know, getting out and putting yourself out there more so, like mm. even your own performance or getting embarrassed or like, I know how this is going to go yeah. down. Yeah. No, well, we kind of can't, we can't really think like that, can we? Like be, I don't, I don't even know what to. Well, because you're yeah. dancing up on it yeah, yeah. in the middle of oh, the road. Yeah, 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 so yeah. much. Oh. But we feel like the the more shameful, the better content, <laughs> which is true. Sucks, we but suck sucks doing it because we hate oh, doing it. Like, no, I mean, sometimes it's it. fun, but like now it's getting harder and harder because. Like we did this one, that Byron Bay oh, we're dancing cool like, worst. oh my God, I've never cringed so hard in my life. And, and we didn't like- Depends where you go. Like, so you you yeah. go to the opera house and there'll be just a bunch of tourists that, and you do not care one bit. But there's people everywhere. But if you go somewhere, people kind of know who you are. It's just, and it's busy. You're just like, oh my God, I feel sick. Mm. But it makes the best content. So you just got to man up and do it. Yeah. yeah so you're knowing what- yeah, when you know that that feeling's happening, this it could Just be good. Be good. Yeah. yeah, could what? be good or very could, bad. Yeah. What about um, careers and look and how you see careers? Obviously, this has been a massive pivot for you guys. What's the learning been so far? The learning. Mm. Good question. It's yeah, it's hard because everyone asks what we want to do. Yeah, like what's this going to lead to? And we still kind of don't really know. We know we want to like. Mm. I but don't it's know. just too broad. Like every day. You get, you, you're like, yeah, this is a good guide of where we want to head. Mm-hmm. And then you get an email that just changes everything. And you're like, okay, let's try this. Yeah, and so then, we, but yeah. I mean, like, yeah, it's, I don't even know. Like we got, we, we did the Aries interviewing for the first time. I don't know if you guys, or oh, I guess this is no. interviewing, but have you done like. Yeah, not that, but like TJ's done a bit of red yeah, carpet we, stuff. Yeah, and I was trying to be a presenter on the red carpet, the. Logie Awards. Yeah. And yeah, then yeah. you know the pain. And, like. <laughs> it, it's, it's hard, eh? It's difficult. Well, it's just unnatural. So, yeah, it's a weird situation. I kind of had the presenter yeah. sort of the posture. Yeah. Where okay, I, yeah. Like I think you Good guys are, are, like if I was to watch myself or any, you guys, I'd prefer to watch. Yeah. yeah. You, you, well, know, you guys are playing You yourselves. guys over a presenter. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's so much more, like yeah. I think what your awkwardness about yeah. it is yeah. why it's amazing. Yeah, 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 <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. And so the people that. Young Mr. 97, he's great talent. Does not want to be da- talent whatsoever. <laughs> Mr. 97. But he man. makes the best parts yeah. of our show. Like he makes, yeah. there's so many great moments of our show that he's putting himself out there, but he doesn't, really doesn't want to do it. Yeah. yeah. And so that's that, not, I think the early day of the naivety, because you don't want to be like, I fucking got this. Yeah. yeah. Oh, honestly, you, that's our biggest fear is looking cocky and like dickheads. Like, <laughs> well, you took the Rolex watch before you came on the show. Which <laughs> yeah, I just take that off. <laughs> take <laughs> the gold chain off. Out of your, out of your suits. <laughs> yeah. What do people that you went to school with say about the stuff that you make? They're surprisingly very, very supportive. Everyone's so supportive yeah. and nice to us. Like, it's so cool. It's really nice yeah. to see. Like, everyone that we see is just like, we love it. And like, we get yeah. so many nice messages. It's pretty cool. Like, because people could bag us out for yeah. sure, be like, mm-hmm. these guys are not yeah. known dickheads. I don't know. It's been like. Yeah. I remember. You, you're putting yourself out there, and it's like people could just 
yeah, rip you, yeah. like write you off. But everyone's so nice to us. It's I guess because really cool. everyone says like you're just doing you, which makes it so much easier for everyone to just yeah take in and be like they're yeah, not they're trying cool. to be anything. We're not, we're not really. like yeah. it's not like we're trying to be someone else. So but people people at school are like oh, that's what. You boys yeah. are like, just yeah. Loose, I guess loose loose who knows what they actually think. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's what they say. I've had a few people said that, like, yeah, you just being yourself, so that's why it's yeah, nice and cool. So that's pretty cool. And yeah. so you were uh, in Melbourne for an MCing gig, which the the event got cancelled because mm. of the weather. Uh, Welcome to Melbourne. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Bipolar weather. It's the, the full like, sunny five minutes before it's like, <laughs> full <laughs> Melbourne experience. Yeah. The yeah. MCing stuff. Tommy and I have done a little bit of it, and we're yeah. Like I stress out beforehand. Mm. <laughs> How are you guys? It was, uh, it's not too, like, it just depends on the situation. I mean, well, we're definitely kind of like, oh, fuck, here we go. Yeah. Like, you kind of put your- It'll be fine. Like, we know we could do it. You put your game face fun. on though. It'd be fun. But like, it's kind of like, oh, fuck, here we go. Like, yeah. I don't know. It could go either way. Mm. Yeah. You just prepare yourself and just- How do positive. you prepare? What's the, What sort of stuff? Oh, my God. Do you have a script? Did you know <laughs> what you had to say? <laughs> no. Like, who you had no. to introduce? We always just go off the cast pretty yeah. much. I remember the Arias, we were like, it came down to like mm. a week before and we're like, all right, we're, we're prepping hard. Let's, prep. Ryan, let's write scripts. Like, just get it dialed. And you got to tell me about an hour before we had to do it. We still hadn't even talked about it. Like, we knew we were going to do it and we were shitting it. Every night we'd be like, all right, we got to do like research tonight. And then it wouldn't happen. <laughs> yeah. like, all right, tonight we'll do it. It just yeah. wouldn't happen. Yeah. And then the morning of, oh, man. we woke up like six to try and like do actually a podcast research. room, yeah, which yeah. we're practicing in. We're just like, like, it wasn't on or anything. We're just like, this and that and that. And then we're like, ah, oh, well, oh, fuck it. We'll be we were, fine. We had no questions like prepared or anything. And we're like walking into it. And then oh, kind of got real when we got in the red carpet. I'm like, holy shit. Like we actually have to interview <laughs> these people. And we, uh, oh, man. Like, I was shitting myself. Oh. Like, And you can't uh, show that you're shitting yourself either. Because <laughs> people are like, because <laughs> it was an hour. Like we, we got told we had to do it. And then well, we're there on the red carpet. And then there was an hour of us just standing there waiting. <laughs> it was so That's long. a good hour to do. Oh, man. Prep. No, yeah, <laughs> no not just at all. Freak out. Yeah. We and weren't even first, talking the almost. The first few interviews were a bit like. How you going? A bit how you going, yeah. It didn't really go that wood. Like, wood? <laughs> wood. <laughs> didn't go very wood. Didn't go very well. Oh, I think not that bad, but it was just a bit awkward. And like the people yeah. were just like, they weren't that keen to Who talk. Who was your first interview? It's actually two radio hosts. Uh, two. Sally and Erica. Uh-huh. Yeah. So. Uh, and then Ooh. we kind of like we joke and pretend we didn't know like they were artists, but we knew who they were. But like, oh, so when's a new album coming out? And they kind of like, do they guys know oh, where? Man. So it got a bit awkward. Good learning then, curve. And then we like kind of wrapped it up pretty quick. And the chick we were with that was like hosting it, hosting us. Was like, who was it for? Who was it? Was for um, cool accidents. Yeah, like warning, the morning music. Warning music. Yeah, and yeah. she was kind of like, oh, maybe try and talk a little bit longer. And I was like, oh fuck, like yeah. I feel like it lasted like an hour. Oh, and man. Like, oh no, that and then was cringe. So great. Did you, who was the most f- famous person that you got on the carpet? Who that, that Morgan Freeman? Or, uh, Morgan, Morgan Evans. Evans. Morgan Evans. <laughs> Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Who's that? Is that the actor? Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Who is that? <laughs> Who is that? John Norman's actor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Morgan yeah, Freeman. yeah that's right. <laughs> Who is that? Oh. He was in um, Green Mile. Yeah. Yeah. He wouldn't, he is wouldn't Morgan admit. Freeman the guy who had like yeah. a bucket list and stuff? Yeah, he's yeah, got yeah, the, yeah. the deep the, voice. The big he's dog. like, he's yeah. God. Yeah, yeah, God. Um. And so Morgan Evans, Morgan Evans, we're like, I don't know, Ocean he was Alley the most Boys famous and stuff. Ocean Alley, I don't know if you know them. No, I mean, okay. across the music stuff. So, yeah. did you find, did you then find your groove? Yeah, oh. from not having we a. We did, we did. Yeah, yeah, did yeah, you yeah, have like did. a go to question that you knew would do really well? Oh, uh, yeah. I was, uh, there's a few. We're like, oh, shit, I can't tell us. Come on, come on, come on, give us one. Yeah. Come on. What do we say? Oh, God. Oh, one went bad. Like, what after party are you going to? Are we coming? Do you have a boyfriend? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Do you have a boyfriend? Yeah. That, ends that always went, yeah, that went well besides a couple of times. <laughs> Every time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wait, what happens with Morgan Evans? That was so cringe. Oh, oh you, you stuffed up bad. Oh, <laughs> God. What did you say? You're like, are you Australian or American? I knew he was American. No, I, mean, he's Australian. I knew he was Australian, but he's been in America like for ages and he's killing over there. But he thought I didn't have a clue. So I, I was like, are you Australian? Or American. He was like, he's like, he was so offended. He was yep. like, looked at me like rattled. And, I, and then <laughs> I, was looking, I was looking at you going, you idiot. What did you ask Oh that? my God. It just got so awkward, but we recovered. Yeah. You watched the- How did you recover? Oh, I can't You finished remember. the interview. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 
yeah. we'll be covered by him walking yeah. off and going fuck yeah. see ya um, yeah, but you watch a recap video it looks hilarious because you don't only see the good things when yeah. you interview and it did go well but it did like, like, it depends it who you're talking to like if you're talking to people that are keen to talk and yeah it went yeah. fine well um, hey, do you Joe know Brad it. Blanks no he, who was on Hamish and Andy like a red carpet reporter he's oh. from the state lives over in New York um, we've had him on the, but he's a oh, you know, yeah. seven foot looking giant who, you know, sort of stumbles around, but yeah. it's a part of his shtick. So <laughs> he's really great. Like, I think he's amazing at what he does and he's, and he's built that kind of approach. Mm. I don't know if he, I think he does, uh, probably now he does um, do his prep, <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> but yeah. he also doesn't drop his natural approach to it, which That's is good. what you guys are talking about. Yeah. yeah. And that was good. And then we did the GQ man of the year award the night after. So we're like, we've never done this kind of stuff, like interviewed anyone. And then two nights in a row, we had these like massive events. Yeah. The, and I think the GQ one. That was proper famous. That was, and we that like, was a lot of fun because yeah. I feel like we had, we did it, we got it out of the way. Like we did yeah. the first one. But oh. that out of the way, I'm like, oh, right. I was so that sick was, for that. Oh. What was, was wrong? What sort of? I was, so, I was like, so before the GQ, so after the Aries, we didn't eat for like 12 hours, I think. We didn't have a meal. Or, and then I got this no like snacks. crazy stomach bug. Like uh -huh. I got probably gastro or something. It's very so common. You definitely had gastro. I had gastro. Uh, yeah, yeah, you, you were oh, I was yeah. spraying that bowl. <laughs> <bowl. laughs> I'm not joking. I've never smelled things coming out that bad before. Oh, <laughs> almost like sort of a... Like, yeah, there's oh, a certain man. smell. Yeah, it smells like it smells sick. It was a like yeah, yeah, fire yeah, yeah. hydrant. Like, like, uh, sick. There's a dead person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Or like the, it's yeah, like the insides. <laughs> yeah, you feel it. like it's going into you and making yeah. you sick. And, and I so, did get sick. I got really yeah. sick after that. And, and then, so what happened that night? We, oh, we were walking around the street trying to. He was freaking out because he's like, "This is one of the biggest nights of our career so far. You need to fucking pull your." Yeah, but it wasn't. But I was like, I was like shaking in bed, like so sick. Oh my god! Do you reckon it was stress from how the areas went? I don't know. Yeah. Post traumatic <laughs> stress. <laughs> oh, I don't know. and then we then what happened? Like we're walking down the road. He was really sick, and then was like, "We we're gonna have to get dressed and go up in like twenty minutes." Um, and he's like, "No, nah, we need to go to like the chemist." So we went to the chemist and like got him some like pills and stuff. Gastro stuff. Yeah, <laughs> gastro stuff like hydrolytes, a bunch yeah. of things. Yeah, he was he was just feeding me tablets. I hate. I was tablets. like, I have two of them. Like, I have two. Like, yeah. Were you wearing the same suits or the same no, we outfits? Had, we had some funny we outfits, some and you had a really oh funny my outfit on. God, mine was horrible. It was like this big pink suit, fur like, coat, fur, like, like a full Gucci, like like kind of oh, outrageous with these cream coloured <laughs> flares. It was disgusting. <laughs> oh, had so an earring good. in. So oh, good. Man. And then. And then like, you had to put on the brave face. And, and then, then you got in the elevator and got out of it. And I, I was like sitting down in the elevator, going down to it. And we we're, were like, this is on. Like, this is, we're on for a big <laughs> night here. And I was, I was just going, all right, I'm going to do the a dance or like an interview and go <laughs> straight to bed. I mean, I'm so sorry, Falcon. And then um, the adrenaline just kicked in and I was fine the whole night. Yeah, was and that weird. was really fun. Yeah. Because like good. I said, we got the first interviewing done the night before. Mm. And then we we're just a bit more comfortable. Yeah. And yeah. then there was a bit more relaxed feel like. Well, like, yeah, because well, you're over the fence yeah, yeah. with mm -hmm. the Aries one, and that one was just like you're with them, and I don't know, that was so and, much fun. That was the best night. And we, so we, yeah, we're doing interviews. We had like a publicist with us, but it was like not serious. They had the actual interviewers, and we were just like shit kickers, like yeah. walking around. But we somehow got like some massive names. And then, do you know Zendaya? Yeah, yeah. So we didn't have a clue who it was. There was this <laughs> other dude that everyone's like, we're here for Zendaya. Like Zendaya's the face of the night, and we're like, who the hell is Zendaya? I remember asking someone anyway, and then. Someone walked in and everyone was like, oh, my God. And I just assumed that was Zendaya. <laughs> it was a dude. Zendaya's a girl. And I was like, that's Zendaya right there. And I, and I was <laughs> in this. Zendaya. I was like, is it? And, like, <laughs> and I was in it. We were in an interview with Joel Creasy. Do you know? Yeah. He, he does. He, he was hosting that night. He was amazing. He was so good. So good. So we were interviewing in, like a host. So it was, that was hard enough. And I said to him, I was like, oh, how do you feel that Zendaya's behind you? And he turned around and it was just that dude. That was <laughs> some, model, some model dude. And he turned back around. And he's like. Oh, yeah. He, like, covered my ass, thank God. Yeah, He's yeah, like, yeah, good. And I was like, oh, that's good. <laughs> and then after we finished him, Zendaya walked in, and it, I was like, that's Zendaya. And we ended up interviewing her. Probably like, one of the best interviews yeah. we did as and well. What is, what's Zendaya's deal? She, she's, she's a big she's, actor. She won, like, Woman of the Year. She's an actor on I think Euphoria. she might have even done... Um, she's massive. She, she might have like, been a singer as well, she's maybe. Got music, she's got, like, yeah. 70 million yeah. followers on Instagram. She And she was yeah, she was super nice, and that was, like, one of the best interviews yeah. we did. Just because, I guess... We didn't know who she was. didn't know who they are, like, who she mm, was. Yeah. And yeah. She was a really good talker, so it was just fun. And then... And you mm. didn't open up with, are you Australian or American? <laughs> no, 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 no. Thank God. Do you, think the, do you think the no 
prep or not having too much info actually serves, serves it. Definitely. It's like today with the Today Show, we, I think we, they sent us questions they're going to ask us. You did like, We don't want to know. We yeah. don't want to know. We'd rather just like- just off the cusp. Yeah. Just and and what, it. Were they, did they panic or what was the- it, No, it was kind of- we were pretty nervous. We're, I was oh, nervous yeah. before. I didn't even know what we said. We so did you walk like, off? Did you fucking <laughs> dance and walk off? Or yeah, something? yeah, they're like, dance, dance. I was like, oh, get So fucked. was it a live cross? <laughs> so were they in the Sydney studio no, was, or they were no, all in Melbourne? Yeah, we were there, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. Australian Open. Bro- yeah. Live broadcast from live yeah. broadcast. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah and so the hosts. Uh, it was, was Carl was, Stefanovi and someone, but they were meant to do it. Like, we went to get interviewed by them, but then they had to leave like 20 minutes. Oh, like 10 minutes before. Oh, so we didn't get the... Seven squares. Yeah. Oh, this is great. Right. Right. Well, I forget their name. Uh, uh, Alex and Tracy. Yeah, Alex and Tracy. They were really nice. Yeah. They were legends. And yeah. so how long did you spend on the Today Show? <sighs> it was like five or six minutes. And that doesn't sound like that long, but... When it's live yeah, television. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and w- yeah it wanted to go longer by the end. Seriously, I walked off and I was like, I don't know what I just said. Like, <laughs> I feel like my head was about to blow up. Like, just going like, oh. I was like, walked off. I was like, what just happened? You walked off and he's like... Wait, I don't know one thing that just happened. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no, we've done well, hopefully. Yeah, it was good. And but then you got the text from your mum. Yeah. yeah. I'm crying. Yeah. yeah. I'm like, boy, it was a bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Shame on our family. <laughs> yeah. Back to the job site, mate. Yeah. Um, so, you should go, Josh. Uh, the, um, I'm just curious on the preparation thing because it makes, it does make a lot of sense from one point of view. The, there's the other bit, which is like, Oh, well, if you if you knew if they were Aussie or Australian, like uh, yeah. you were American, it would be easier mm, yeah, as well. <laughs> I <It> would be, <laughs> definitely. But um, mm. how are you with like retaining facts? Like when uh, TJ and I have done mm. emceeing One, yeah, yeah. and it's like, okay, I need to remember that uh, Nando's get their chilies from 1600 farmers oh. in South Africa. I fucking remember that now, but normally on the night I actually yeah. forget. Oh my God. Yeah, seriously. Oh, Are there God. any facts that you remember? Because I feel like short term I'm not good, but then long term I still remember this shit. Yeah, in <laughs> the moment you just go, facts. you can't think of it. Yeah. Like, Have if, you emceed any other gigs? Or not, no. re- not really. We've got a couple coming up, I what think. What else have we done? But not, not like that, not proper. What about the Arias? What did you actually look at <laughs> oh, before you? Not, honestly, we tried, we had like a. a a name of all the artists with and their he, face. Did you say have a photo? <laughs> no, no. Really? We tried it. No, nah, it was just so, like their names. And we tried to look them all up. We listened to like Triple J and that a lot. We're pretty like big in like music. Yeah. We love music, yeah. so mm-hmm. we knew a few of them who they were, but still not that many. But still, you're not like, oh, yeah, how's your son Carl going? Like, has heard he's got this and that. Carl like, Stefano. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Carl. <laughs> yeah, the son called Carl these days. <laughs> <laughs> or like, you know, there's like artists where you know who they are, but you can't. Pinpoint what song they are, yeah, or you yeah. know the song, but you can't pinpoint the artist. It's a little bit like yeah. that. I, remember like, it. I know you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm, you. I said to one of the girls, okay, who was it? Just, KLP? No, I can't remember. She was dating someone that we just interviewed literally a minute before her. And I was like, oh, yeah, so do you have a boyfriend? <laughs> She's like, well, it's good to see you've done your research. I actually have a wedding, wedding <laughs> ring yeah, on it. Yeah, yeah. I'm married and I have a kid. I love it's it so disruptive awkward. though because they, they all assume that everyone talking to them has done their mm, research. Yeah. It's like, mm. Don't assume I've done my yeah. fucking research. <laughs> Your publicist came to us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're actually real desperate right yeah, now yeah, on yeah. the red carpet. We don't know you. There's, people, there's times when people just walk up and start talking to us and we just interview them and then they'd walk off and we're like, who was that? Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> Did anyone know you guys? And so it was, you didn't know them, but. Like they knew you. people did. We got a few photos yeah. with people like like singers. Like, like yeah, Hayden James. Hayden James. But we kind of knew some a couple of girls. I can't remember their names. Um, some young artists. No one. No one important. Yeah. So yeah. Hayden James. No, he's no. important. He's a good, good guy. Are you guys dating anyone at the moment? Are you single or what's the deal? No, single. 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 And so does that does that complicate things as you start to become more popular? You've mentioned girls mm. a lot. <laughs> uh, is, is, does that become a, a harder thing? Stay away. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. Nah. Nah. Um, I don't know. <laughs> What's the deal? You, yeah. you guys on Tinder? No, no definitely no, not. What no. are you, are you Raya? Why not? Why you not? Raya? You said that like you-, you Yeah, what's wrong with Tinder? Yeah, what? They only date people from the Aries. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. You're not a celebrity, you don't talk to <laughs> yeah, me. Yeah, it's the red carpet <laughs> list. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Which no, they'll forget. <laughs> no, it's single. I don't know. Yeah. It just, it's just, it's just easier. Yeah. Especially with, I mean, we're too busy. Yeah, but exactly. You know, we're focused on a career. We can't let any distractions. 
No distractions. No, we just, I guess we just haven't met the right person. Yeah. No, yeah. <laughs> what about you boys? You guys? Yeah. yeah. yeah thanks for doing your research. Yeah. 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 yeah 12 Do years I, with my girlfriend. Oh, yeah. yeah I'm married. Oh, yeah. 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 Um, Kitty turns three. Bodie. Oh, nice. in, uh, Bodie. In February. Congratulations. So mm. That's going to be a big party. Young big, Bode. Big Saturday. Yeah. yeah. You getting, him on, down for it. getting him on the podcast soon or what? Yeah, he's been on he's a couple of times. a year off. Ooh. He's been sat on my lap and didn't talk. The one time <laughs> yeah. I fucking wanted yeah, him yeah. to. No way. But then he got on Mason's lap and spoke to us. Yeah, yeah. He's 90, a bit camera shy. 97. Yeah. 97. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Mm. Um, no, but he'll get on the podcast a bit more. We're doing this Sweet. for a long time, so we, nice. you you'll see him evolve. Eight years left here? Yeah, eight, eight years. Eight years. Yeah. Uh, when it comes to traveling, what's the longest time you guys have gone traveling for? Oh, it'd be 15 months. 15 months. That's, a, that's mm. longer than that a year. That was my first trip too. That was good. Seven months. That was, that's that's less no than a year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah that is yeah, that's yeah, yeah. just months. over half a year. <laughs> yeah, um, pussy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, why so little? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so I um, miss my mum. And so <laughs> what? The um, the texts weren't coming through. <laughs> was the text from mum. From mum. Oh, mom, yeah. well, they were coming through. They were coming through. I'm crying. Come again. home. Yeah, yeah you, you weren't. You weren't anyone then, so she didn't care about you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Stay over there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, don't yeah, come, come over to your someone. It was so, yeah. Actually, yeah, only uh, over 100k. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I contact you when you hit 100. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, okay, mother. <laughs> and so what was the traveling experience uh, like? Where did you guys go? Well, well my places. trip was this last one we went on. We went to Europe and we started this mm. whole thing. Um, yeah, it was Europe, so. That was unreal. That where, was where in Europe? Uh, so we started it in the French Alps. We did like a snow, like a couple of months there, snowboarding and stuff. And then went back to England. We worked for a bit, just like on job site, labouring. That was for like three experience. weeks. Yeah. We got a two year working visa and worked for three weeks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we didn't even use the visa. We ended up getting paid cash. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> labouring. Um, <clears throat> that was funny. We were going millions to, of parking fines. <laughs> yeah. We plan to stay longer. It sounds like you laughed as if you haven't paid them. Yeah, we're yeah. just laughing because my name's on the car and I'm not allowed back in the country. Yeah. Oh, no, it's not joking. Is, is there, uh, <laughs> really? What's it? How much debt do you think? There's a, there, well, let's just say there's court notices once a week. Coming, where are you finding? Going where? <laughs> to my cut. So we, actually, I don't, I don't know. Maybe I don't know if I should be saying this. Yeah, you're going to trace. They're going to trace you down. Gonna trace you down. No, they're not tracing you. <laughs> no. no, we, so we, we only got like, what, three, four parking fines maybe? But it was, it was, Sent back to my cousin's house, which is where we signed up with the car and stuff. Mm. And then he's he reckons he gets like seven a fortnight. He, like, yeah. Mail. How much are we talking price wise to get oh, it sorted? It just to, to clear it yeah. all up. Oh god, I don't even know. I, I just told him from all in the bin. And my honey went and visited him not long ago. But if it's only like say a hundred pounds, oh no, it'd be thousands by now and there's like court, a court <laughs> notice and stuff I mean this is, yeah what happens how do they I'm just gonna What's, find out when I go to England next I mean yeah. better to do this Ash Williams comedian he he, he does the same but in Australia does he? <laughs> which is a bit more heat on your ass yeah, yeah. No way. when it's overseas it's a bit different yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. he has to move around a lot <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just sort of living in an yeah. igloo and so you, are you expecting that when you go to oh. England you're gonna be at immigration I don't and know. they'll be like a beep, 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 beep. Some, like, done some, if, I had a few similar things happen in Canada. <laughs> this really? guy's on the run. Hey? He's running for something. What happened in Canada? <laughs> oh, forgot to pay a, a bank some money for like a withdrawal fees and that just built up for so long and then left my car on the side of the road <laughs> and a couple more phone bill things. So you're not good at admin? Well, when you're overseas and you have zero money mm -hmm. you, and your parents have already lent you a couple grand, right. you're just yeah. like, I can't do it. And then Canada was fine. I went back and got another two-year visa after that. So they're, they're pretty nice, aren't they? They're pretty you nice. Change banks. <laughs> yeah, that's what yeah. I did. Yeah. Changed three phone companies. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this has to be a thing, right? They're going to expect that people are coming over from other countries. Yeah, I'm just worried about the England thing for you. I know. We'll we'll find That'd be out. Fine. But, but uh, <laughs> I'm going to fly to Paris it, and then like. I don't know. And then you're going to train yeah, you it can in drive boating, train, yeah. you just can swim train over. <laughs> yeah, you can. You can get or train, you yeah. could see the cost of the fines. Yeah. Because maybe all of that clusterfuck of you a know, travel arrangement <laughs> is more expensive. In Australia, Honestly. I think it was Victoria maybe, might have done in New South Wales, they did a um, people who have fines, the sheriff's department. Oh, the amnesty? Is yeah, and so they were like, come to our big booth. It looks like some something you get a you know taco out of a truck, but you actually go up and pay no a massively reduced Really? Amount for your fines it's and like they a brand wipe. activation. Really, you get a, little, you get a marvelous <laughs> creations bar on the way out or whatever. <laughs> yeah, big yeah. yeah, pole. They yeah, you pay it and then 
Or he finds a guy. Smart. I'd, well, it's only maybe, England anyway. Don't, don't even need yeah. to go back there. It wouldn't be too bothered. Yeah. But if, no. your ma- if your parents are watching, you do, you, you, I'm a good, you abide a by here in yeah. Australia? Oh, yeah. You can't do that yeah, stuff yeah. here. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, definitely not. Is that not. the cops? Yeah. <laughs> here, knock at the door. Got to go. You wouldn't want to do that here. Every fine's like $400. Insane. Yeah. We've been racking up a few lately. Oh, a few parking, parking fines. fines in Sydney. Ugh. Honestly, every oh, time we go down up, there to CBD. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah they honest, get us. Like if it's lot. 15 minutes over, you're done. They're so savage. They it's so you know, heavy. We have so we've had so many. Like it'd be like 15 minutes, half an hour over. Bang. You rock up and there's a fine. You're like, what are you doing Rrr. in there for filming or a meeting or something? Yeah, we go, we're in Sydney often, like very often now. Just Maybe like three, yeah, four days a week. You could have rented a place with the fines you've had. Oh, oh, honestly. <laughs> but yeah, even still, to rent a place, you don't really get a car spot in yeah. Sydney. Yeah. I love that it was a consideration. <laughs> it's like, yeah, no, but the thing with the rentals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, yeah parking even oh, in like on. Parramatta is seriously expensive. That's when we went up for to do a job. It was like. CBD parking is mm-hmm. a hundred and something bucks a day for a park. Oh, that's yeah, insane. Outrageous. In one of those big car parks. And so were yeah. you actually chasing the snow? Like, so like season, you know, like I've mm. never gone skiing or snowing mm. before. I'd love to. Snow- <laughs> snowing. 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 Is that what I said? Yeah. Yeah. Snowing. 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 snowing, kids. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go snowing. Yeah. Yeah. Find my photos on the Facebooks. Yeah. <laughs> snowing. Good banter, boys. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pay your fines. Yeah. <laughs> Can we edit this in? Yeah. And, Absolutely not. And so the, the, snow, the snowing stuff, you fuckers. Yeah. <laughs> Chasing the snow. snow, that's a thing, like the mm. seasons or whatever. So the seven months in Europe, was that going from one cold place to another? No, nah, just for a couple yeah. of months. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Three months maybe. But you, you, like you were chasing mm. winters yeah. around. I've been doing that for years. Yeah, like you go to Canada, then you'd go New Zealand yeah. and Canada. And yeah. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I'll just for him and then he's doing it this. I love the snowing. A season in Australia? Have you done, what, do you uh, go to yeah. Perisher or? Yeah. yeah. Uh, normally go to New Zealand, but uh, this year I done Perisher mm. and it was good. Um, but I just drove from home. Nothing like the mountains overseas. No, not at all. It's uh, a bit disappointing here in Australia. It is. Um, do you like hiking? I no, I hate you do hiking. Not. Yeah. <laughs> I like getting. I like yeah. being at the top. Have you been helicoptered in before? No, have not. That's that's heliboarding. You can do that. I haven't been heliboarding. Was that the di- what's the difference between being helicoptered in and heliboarding? <laughs> <Nothing. laughs> heliboarding's the name of it. Yeah. You can do it in. Heli- you can do it in Heli- um, Victoria yeah. as well. Yeah. Yeah, you can. Yeah. It just can't. takes you to tracks that you mm. wouldn't be able to get mm. to, and then yeah. And so would you? Would you go in? Um, what's it called? Backpackers. What's that called when a backpacker? Oh lives yeah, somewhere? I know you're talking about like a hostel. Yeah. Hostel. <laughs> Hostels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A refuge. <laughs> is that it? Do you uh, do you go into hostels or how do you normally travel around? But yeah, both, both hostels both. and Airbnbs. Airbnbs now. There they go. Yeah. It depends. Yeah, and but hostels as well. Yeah. I awesome. saw. Um, you don't have to say the hotel because you're still here for a night. <laughs> the, where you're staying, it seems GT. pretty funky. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's a big hotel. It's not yeah, like yeah, yeah. Yeah. Seven Hotham Street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why would you say that? Yeah, the police are going to be there now. The, yeah. Yeah. the English uh, police, yeah. big pommy hats. Uh, <laughs> here with the Queen. I, I saw you getting well into the room service. Oh, so yep. good. Is the client paying? I, they yep. are. <laughs> 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 We're definitely not. Yeah. <laughs> If Wouldn't they, be buying it otherwise. <laughs> yeah. So did they? Uh, did they put their credit card down? Yep. Oh, that's yeah. Good. Yeah. That's good. It's pretty. It's funny. I actually we're feel just, sick. I feel like, that oh, last one I had. We like, 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 too much. Uh, we had a chicken burger. Burgers yeah. hotel. I mean, <sighs> not it's a good. great hotel. That great you, hotel. Great at. food. Um, but <laughs> hotels in general, I found burgers to go either way. Yeah. Oh man, don't want to talk about it. I feel sick. Because yeah. <laughs> you ate too much. I think because yeah. you ate too much. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's, it's, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, keep it at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. keep it at that. Um, how's your? Are you guys grew up together, or you, or do you work together in we, that team? We met about seven months ago. No, we're like mates from high school. Okay, yeah. So yeah. we met like a ten or eleven years ago. Yeah. How's um? How's your relationship? Bad. Yeah. Shit. Well, has I it been? That. Has it no. changed since you've been doing yeah. this shit? It's pretty funny. We get along quite well, which mm. is lucky. We were actually talking about the other day, like since we've been traveling, we've pretty much spent. We're married. Li- yeah. Literally yeah. married. Like nearly every day together. In the same just, bed. Like, <laughs> once. Yeah. And we was like, there's so many times we were just like, I don't know. We're mm. just together always. And we actually do it pretty well. Yeah. 
Think I would like every now and again we have like. Do you have blow ups? Annoy the, not really. Not really. Blow ups. Like, you just, what's you know, the biggest at when <sighs> you telepathically know when you're pissing each other off yeah. and you just have half an hour apart, then yeah, you come back. Really? Like, yeah, I you're, just you're like, like <laughs> I know this shit. Like I just I'm annoying. What triggers As, Jack? I you? just consistent <laughs> being. You know, like just I don't know. Just Very does it good make good? Do you get, get around Insta stories much? Like do you do? <laughs> And is that ever sort of a contentious issue? I know people well, get angle. can get more annoying on Insta stories. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Sometimes. Depends what mood. When we're hungover, it's not good. It's, yeah. You just, what, you know, to be around each other? Because nah, you get those stupid moods where you just don't care about it's funny, anything. Yeah, it's yeah. funny though. We well, never really have any big laughs. No, nah, never. Not never yet anyway. Not, not, not yet, yet anyway. What about when it's connected to the money stuff? Because Josh and I, mm-hmm. we, we had a friendship before, but <laughs> we've spent more time in business than mm-hmm. we have our yeah. friendship, our friendship has been a part of the business, yeah. but our friendship is a business. Yeah, we've we're so scaling, we're we're scaling it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're trying to cash out on our friendship, yeah, yeah, yeah. but I think it changes things. Mm-hmm. We've got mm-hmm. the clear approach of the daily talk show, and big media companies, our business. We're mm-hmm. doing you know X, Y, and Z. We mm-hmm. bring on young mate. Um, ninety seven. Ninety seven. What do you? Mm-hmm. What do you? What's the approach to money and seeing how, where this goes with your friendship? Well, I just take 90%. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what about, like, have you thought about, like, say, for instance, a radio show? If you were ever to get, you know, Hamish and Andy, mm. have you ever thought about the order in which your names would go? <laughs> yeah. Pretty similar names, aren't they? Matt, yeah. Fight to the Matt death. And Jack, just Jack and Matt. Jack and Matt. Jack and Matt. Well, and Jack. Uh, Mr. 97 put that together. There's a sign that we have that has <laughs> your That's names it. This on it. Decided. Yeah, who what is it? It was... Jack and Matt. Jack oh, and Matt. I thought was wrong. I thought it was wrong. Yeah, I think I it's Matt wrong. and Jack sounds yeah, yeah, yeah. better. Matt and Jack. Matt, Matt and Jack. Jack. Jack and Matt. Matt and Jack. Jack and Matt. You can have it first. Matt well. and Jack. We'll just change every week. Yeah. <laughs> no. I mean, <laughs> money, I don't think money's nah. in it. Well, we share the same bank account, so. It's we split it. Split, what, yeah, what do you really, mean? You just, we literally like, have the same bank account. What, like, what about like splurge and um, well, fire extinguisher? <laughs> barefoot, every, barefoot's buckets. Everything yeah. we pay for is like split it. Pretty yeah, much. Like, really. Why don't you just sort out this fine thing? Like, I feel like this <laughs> debt uh, that Jack going. has is going to piss you off, Matt, down the track. No, it's because fine. then all yeah, of a you sudden you're going to have issues going into. <laughs> yeah. Like all of a sudden, this is. I'll I'll put a scenario together that could destroy your friendship. <laughs> yeah. uh, Veggie yeah. might. Veggie uh, might says, uh, guys, uh, we've done a little uh, promotion where we've got access to the Queen. <laughs> and um, what we then we'll pay it. We'll yeah, pay it and, and so that no, but the thing is, it's too late. It's too late. Too late. And so the thing is, uh, you're meant to do this bit of gear where she tries Vegemite for the first time. It's a great bit of banter, similar to the stuff, the Aria stuff. You get on the flight. All of a sudden, Jack can't get into the country because of the fines. It costs it's you guys it that it's fifteen. Matt, I get all the money. Yeah. Here. No, no, no. You both lose it. Ugh. How do you feel now? That's Matt. No. Then you should have put the, ca- the car in your name, shouldn't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's a joint issue. So do you see, I feel like, Jack, that I'm sensing that it was a joint decision with the fines? What do you think? Yeah, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll go out of here. We'll <laughs> the courts will decide. No, yeah. What do you, yeah. no, you, you actually no, What do you actually think about them? That, that wouldn't bother me. I was with him, so like... Yeah. Doubt, doubt I'm just doing, in as much the wrong as him. So. Yeah, okay. But yeah. Well, I am in the wrong. Yeah, because yeah. it's your name. Yeah. But he says the name when it's so. <laughs> it's better no, just to know. not worry about it. Let it, <laughs> let it fly over the head. It's yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. Worry about it when it comes to it. Yeah. That's Cross how that bridge when it comes to it. How you approach life and it's yeah. been all right so far. Do you think about um, radio? Like I feel like <clears> especially the duo format, there's obviously lots of opportunities around Australia mm. for breakfast shows and mm. regional shows and all that sort of thing. Have, has anyone come to you and said you guys should do that? Mm. We've had uh, yeah, we we met up with people from Triple J, but that did they didn't offer us like a yeah. show or anything. But I mean, our managers kind of like said, "Would you just be keen yeah. on it?" And I mean, I don't I, know at the moment. Yeah, Take, just playing it by ear. We're not the best speakers, <laughs> yeah, or readers. So how did the manager find, good. like how did the manager relationship start? Um, she was on to <clears> us early. She uh-huh. found us at about seven. K probably. Mm-hmm. Okay. They Seven. offered us like a job. Yeah. And a then a um, brand like it came, needed someone for them. So needed a plasterer. <laughs> you need yeah, a plasterer yeah, and a chippy, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. But um new podcast studio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then we what then we um and then she didn't offer offer to manage us then. We we kind of went through that one and then about two weeks later another phone call and then another one and then she's like, I want to manage you boys and we were like, We're coming in, we're coming up, we're doing all right, we don't need to rush into anything. 
and we just played it by ear for a while and we actually got hit up a couple more times off other managers but she was killing it for us yeah. we just had a good vibe she's and cool she's and we're not signed so yeah. I mean it wasn't scary like yeah. we're not like oh we're signing our life away right now so and it's gone really good yeah, she, like we get on she's so, so good funny. like we're just annoying the shit out of her in um, the oh. hotel room before like she's, a, she's hungover yeah. and we're just she's we manage her half the time yeah honestly <laughs> this true we've been managing her or this going on has she come down to the to Melbourne with you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, great. She's, she's a brute. You don't want to mess with her. Yeah. So she, is, she pulling, is she pulling you into line? We're pulling her Def, into line, no, honestly. She, she's a party animal. Yeah. She parties harder than us for sure. But yeah. what about when it's like, you say you're going on the Today Show, you don't look at the questions. What's that conversation like? She's She lets us do us, I think. Yeah. She steers in the right direction if it comes to it, but yeah. we can handle ourselves, I hope. Yeah. <laughs> hope no, she's now. good. She's, she's really good. good she'll still like, if there's something needs to be said that she thinks will work really well, she'll tell us. Yeah. Um, have you thought about getting on Cameo? Have you seen Cameo? We, we are on Cameo. Oh, you are on Cameo? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. So I keep my time spent. We actually got to do one. We've got about seven hours left to do one. <laughs> yeah. Leave it to the last minute. Oh, you so you, time. Okay, so what's the timeline? Yeah, what we is We had a few that, uh, what's it called, Sevs? Oh, she's on it. Well, we were, but uh, they were they expired. So our, um, our mate Ryan yeah. John uh, spoke to Sevs and got us set up. But then Sevs only told us after they'd been expired that we were set up. Yeah, but up. they were free. But it still was bad. Yeah. Like, we're in a, <clears throat> as much yeah. trouble as you yeah. are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's not good. I don't know if we're going to be able to get back onto the yeah, came platform. Yeah, yeah. And so, yeah, so you've got seven hours left. How long did they give you? You get three, three days, don't you? They get to choose. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. So, okay. But I, well, I think, because it, it's different, but it's normally about three, four days. Yeah. What so, do people ask for? Is it a birthday message? Yep. Usually. <laughs> birthday, Christmas. Finished exams. Shout out. Yeah. It's, we we don't promote it at the moment, so we're not getting any because we're getting too busy. But when we were, we're doing we're doing a fair few. Mm -hmm. yeah. Are they asking you to dance? Yeah, yeah, dancing, piano, guitar, piano. Yeah, piano. Um, Man and many talents. <laughs> where, did, where did the dancing <clears throat> thing come from? Like, you know, it's, yeah, um, just like going to festivals and stuff, and just being an idiot. Like, yeah. just I don't know. Yeah, just going to festivals and just I don't know. We I got a big group of mates, and we all just dancing like idiots and yeah. it's just it's always now you guys out. are the ones getting paid for dancing yeah, like yeah, idiots yeah, yeah. <laughs> all your yeah. mates are still dancing yeah, like yeah. idiots yeah. way better yeah no it's pretty funny the other week we just we we're dead sober in a room just had, we all had um the speakers on in my mate's room and just were dancing with our eyes shut was that funny yeah <laughs> like, it was like, in the middle of the day it was like 12 o'clock and our mates it was shit but very outside yeah. and was like, when you go to exercise and I was like let's just Put music on and close your eyes and dance. Yeah. <laughs> That's a bit of a workout. Our, our mate was feeling us. It's so funny to look at. We're just, our eyes are shut, just looking like aliens. Uh, our, and uh, our neighbours have a, a good laugh, I think. There's actually a thing I remember going to it in Brunswick, just a suburb close to here, where it'd be in, it was in like this old sort of church hall that they did, you know, um, kids' activities and sort of meetings and shit. And they, like, you know, ballet and shit like that. But they did this one thing that was, and um, they turned the lights completely off and put mu like disco music on and you were to dance. That's and it was so because good. people didn't like, you know, dancing in front <clears> of <throat> people yeah, would be yeah, seen. Yeah, yeah, and so yeah, it was yeah. like a nighttime disco. I think it stopped. That's though. It. It's now that silent <laughs> disco shit. Have you yeah, seen that? Yeah, yeah. That's fine. You got the headphones, headphones on. And you're fine. walking around yeah. the city. Yeah. We've done that with Salty Rain. Do you know Salty Rain? Have you heard of that? No. Nah. What's his actual name? You didn't see that? Um, on the shooting like stars? Australia's Got Talent. Surely you've seen no, that. Oh, that's oh, a good video. Man, it's he's the like, funniest thing ever. Yeah. What's his name? He's Soddy Rain. But oh, oh Timmy, Tommy Franklin. Tommy Franklin. Oh, oh the dude that's yeah. like the yeah, and the beard. The, no, oh, <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. Yes. What's yes. that? The the, oh, the yeah. redheaded dude. Is he redheaded? Yeah, he's ginger ish. Yeah. No, he's definitely. This red. was ages ago. He was. Yeah, ages. yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember. What was the? Pull it out. What was the actual? Thing that he was doing on ninety seven salty yeah. right oh yeah yeah, yeah you yeah. could be mistaken that he looked like a busker or something yeah. and just yeah, walked yeah. In off the street definitely mm -hmm. and he could dance yeah it just like what a does mistaken for a busker mean uh, <laughs> yeah <laughs> could be yeah. homeless well no but <laughs> well, tones, be, uh, tones and I is yeah she was a almost busker. homeless and she's okay. popped <laughs> yeah. she was living out the back of her car yeah her back it, she, he stuck. looked very hippie ish when he was doing when he sure yeah I remember still does and and he still kept a well, yeah. His vibe? Yeah. Don't really know what he's up to now, yeah. but, but we didn't like, even know. Yeah. He was like an idol back then. He was one of the original like um, viral stars. Yeah, like, oh, after for that, sure. Grabbing the clips and then getting posted through social media. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. yeah he, he's classic. He's, yeah, he's dancing. He's on, unreal. Like 
Yeah, that's definitely like get some vibe. inspiration for him, eh? Yeah, for sure. Mm. Have you met him or are you just... No. No. We, we're like dancing saying, near him. We're at the um, we were Disco. We are like 18 we're or like, something. Oh my God, it's him. Like yeah. just following around dancing. He was just going skits. Yeah. So yeah. Funny. yeah. yeah. And so that's you, you pull the dancing inspo. Yeah. A bit of, a bit of, a bit that, of Tommy sure. Franklin. Definitely. Are you uh, still watching Gary V? Gary V, no. no. Not really. Still follow him, but I feel like the inspiration's there. So we what, don't. Do you, what do you reckon Gary V would tell you right now? Like, what's some advice he would spit at you? Put out three it. bits of content a day, what are you pussies? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking 20 a day or nothing. Yeah. yeah. 50, 100. It's TikTok or you're dead. <laughs> yeah. Do you, do you listen to him? Yeah, I mean, it's it's so funny who ends up, yeah. He in what world he goes into. Like, mm. you guys in the, it, he's like so business heavy as oh, well. Oh, so yeah. business heavy. Entrepreneur yeah. world. Yeah. But a bit also of self-help the, as well. Yeah, mm. and then the content creators. I mean, he, what he... What I think he does is impresses people that aren't doing anything and should be putting yeah, out content. For and sure. So I almost have watched him as like it's like a guilty pleasure. <laughs> yeah. I feel bad about what I should be doing and then get inspired about what I should do and then don't yeah. do it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's this never ending spiral. Just so, to lose, lose. <laughs> well, because I, I think for uh, Josh and I, I can still feel like we're not doing enough and we fucking do seven shows a week. Yeah. And I know. So, that's the thing. I know. Oh, when, that's my life. And so when do you feel content? Like when do you guys feel <laughs> most content? Not often. No, yeah. no, always, always, but but never. Yeah, you, nah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, it's honestly, always, never. Yeah, if, never. If, if, if I do you feel the though. pressure of having, like, uh, I guess when you create, even if you don't like it, you've created a brand or a personal brand, and part of that personal brand is um, the larrikin, the mm. like a little bit sort of disconnected. You don't really give a fuck type mm. of thing. Mm. Does that become harder when you start to care more or the spotlight's on you? Mm. I don't know. Not really. I, I mean, no. that's the answer. Mm, that, yeah, that, that's a, I, can't even, I can't even watch a movie with my mates because I feel like guilty. Like literally yeah, so guilty it. that we're not doing enough or I'm not doing enough. But I don't think it changes. No, no. Not really. We can't just be ourselves, but we're just motivated to make this something. Yeah. So it's just uh-huh. like it's kind of, we kind of just want to like yeah. put working because it will lead, hopefully lead to... Yeah, isn't an oxymoron like the the idea of a um a motivated larrikin, mm. like or yeah. or that idea of a, or an ambitious larrikin? Do you mm. see yeah. yourself as ambitious? I do. You yeah. you epo for yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You say epo, epo, epo? for sure. <laughs> What's epo? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> what, did you what, say? Did I, what did I say? <laughs> <laughs> um, I think you said yeah, yeah, epo for sure. Evan, uh, I, I, I thought that was. You're some, very ambitious, and yeah. I guess I am as well. Yeah, like we want to. Sure. It's kind of hard. Isn't it like, isn't it? Isn't it? It's a bit hard, isn't it? Uh, I guess we're just trying to be ourselves, and I don't know. Fuck. (laughs) What are you talking? I don't know. Next question. Uh, Well, yeah. I mean, it's like, how do you? What's the version taking it seriously, but not taking it seriously? So you want to, you want success, but you don't want to just be sort of too focused that it doesn't that you just yeah. lose your yeah. version of you guys you got to yeah. just stop and i feel like the biggest thing for us we stop and pat ourselves on the back when it's that's the most important thing just you do good, that yeah for you, sure we try to how do you just, celebrate just start screaming <laughs> like off on her. yeah no, what we, do you actually do like so say you have a big success or say you oh. find out that you're going to melbourne Australian Open, that's sick. Yeah. You're going to, yeah. you're going to melt, like, yeah. fucking lose yeah. it. You know you're going to get room service. Yeah. You're not going to have to pay. It's sick. We, it is sick. Yeah. So, so you good. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no, my God. Amazing. Amazing. Like, like, we're like little kids in a playground. And yes. so when that happened, what's the what goes on? So you scream. Hug, do you go out and hug get- Hug and just say, congrats, mate. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we, oh, my God. We walked out of a couple of meetings. So many, actually. Like, big, pretty big ones for us. And just been screaming like remember after like Triple J, we were running down the street, high fiving, screaming. <laughs> oh my god, we're just in the what studio. What the fuck is going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, yeah. So yeah. like so funny. Is it, yeah. A couple of times, like, I remember a couple of meetings. Like we're just sitting in front of like five people, and we're like probably hung over and just tapping each other under the table, going, "What is going on right now?" <laughs> and then we walked out, and we just we just start laughing. We just feel like just cacking because we're like, "What the fuck's going yeah. on?" Like. It's crazy. Yeah, it's, it's insane. It's been a pretty crazy few months. And, and then with the content creation stuff, it's like if you guys didn't film yourselves and put it out there, nothing would have happened. Exactly. So yeah. you you then feel the pressure that it's all on you. Yeah. At in some level, because it's like the more you put in, you mm. feel like the more you get back. Or mm. the, yeah, and so there's there's that bad. I feel that pressure when it's mm. like it's all my responsibility, or yeah. it's all like the pre- there is that pressure. 
Because yeah. you, you know if you take responsibility or ownership of it, it's how you can make it actually work. Definitely. Mm. So, what, yeah. like, what's your kind of goal in this? Like, what did you, what do you want to get out of doing this podcast? Yeah, I think with Josh and I have had interesting sort of approaches. I was in radio for a couple of years, place with Shepherd, and you like uh, it? I I lived there for two years doing a breakfast radio show. That was so it. that was like <laughs> that was great. It's it's good. No, awesome experience. It's like yeah. um, I was I was you know 24, 25, and so I was single at that good time. Good age, good age. Great time, just, just getting it done. Loose, just having <laughs> fun, and then I met my wife. While I was doing that, and so <laughs> yeah. anyway, now we're here. But um, <laughs> that was my sort of crescendo of mainstream media. Like yeah, I you wanted love to crescendo. be. You use that in a client crescendo. meeting today. Crescendo <laughs> of the uh, the goal of getting a radio gig or being mm. on telly, right? And so then yeah. that's where that sort of ends. And then I realised there's this other world of uh, that's that's not everything because yeah. it stops. Like there's only a few positions for radio jobs. But then there's this content creation world where you, mm. the sky's the limit as yeah, far as what you create. So that was where my journey then meets Josh's in in terms of my the content creation space. And Josh had been on yeah. his version of that mm. journey. Yeah. yeah. So for for me, it was like production, a lot of behind the scenes stuff. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And then just realizing that this new media thing, like being able to do a show that you can completely mm. control, yeah. you can produce. Not working can, for the man. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So and we've taken from our experience with mainstream media yeah. mm-hmm. and then also the content creation space, creating viral videos and that approach to, yeah. you know, using social media and all those things. Yeah. And sort of brought them together and have formed the product, that's the Daily amazing. Talk Show. And so that's where I love your approach because it's the opposite mm-hmm. of our approach. Our, but it actually fits so well with our approach because yeah, yeah. yeah. our approach is – about like uh, building a community yeah. and having mm. great people on yeah. as well. And yeah. so Do what's real for you, not yeah. some producer that you don't even want to work with. And exactly. so think about it like that six minutes, you have like six minutes on today's show, which is great. But what format do you guys have where you can mm. chat for an yeah. hour yeah, yeah, and exactly. just sort of talk shit? And mm. so that's where we're excited, where it's like, and bringing, connecting all the dots too, like having Hamish and Andy, like having yeah, the- uh, older school, old school sort of media and what they've been able to bring and combine it with the, you know, the mm. new new age yeah, version yeah, as well. Sure. And so, uh, I don't know if this is a bad question, but do you mm. make a living out of this? So, yeah, so yeah. we've started to make money last yeah. year mm. from this and in integ- brand integration, but we have a production company, a video yeah. production company. Uh, where sure. So we've sure. come from working with sort of big brands creating content for them and they're you know, their distribution platforms, Facebook and all of those marketing channels. Mm. And so that's where we kind of, mo- we morph our understanding with that, with this, but it is that goal, right? It's like yeah, you start definitely. this and it was two microphones mm. at Josh's apartment mm. and we didn't video it yeah. and it was very lo-fi to where it is today. It was incredible. With a producer yeah. and a studio and stuff. Yeah, and so it's, it's like there is a level of convincing yourself along yeah, the journey that is, sure. that is, you don't rely on external validation, mm-hmm. but in this game, seeing your numbers grow and stuff is a like sign old, that it's yeah. working, right? You feel like you're old to them. You just want to keep grinding and like yeah. doing it. And so I find like now we're sort of – it's we're being we're – f- we're seeing that external eyes on us or whatever it is mm. and it's like, fuck, this is working. So there's yeah. a injection of another yeah. motivator yeah, sure. that sure. gets you past another yeah. bit. And so mm. it's like you guys – the you know, that time you jump from nine to 25,000, yeah. it's like – Fuck, it's working. Yeah, Let's fire. keep going. Yeah, yeah. Let's keep going. And yeah, the second you slack off is the second you'll die. And, and, like and you getting, just can't do it. And yeah. you, we don't want it. You don't mm. want to do it if you're growing. And like even getting opportunities like this, like getting flown down, and just it's fuel to the fire. You're like, oh, fuck, I thought yes. he was talking about Asher. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Definitely. But yeah, like doing yeah, stuff like this, it is fuel. Like, you're like it's fun. And you're like, yeah. but, but you feel like you gotta pro- now you got to really prove yourself. Yeah. yeah. Can't and just be a little spoiled, bro. It's the start as well. Like I think that's yeah. the other interesting mm. thing is it's like we don't know where it's all going to go. Mm. And so if we just sort of keep our heads down and keep doing it and sort of being open to opportunities mm. and to meeting new people, For it's sure. like how can you lose? Even if like the yeah. show that isn't yeah. successful, the amount of development that yeah. you have For sure. over that time. Yeah, exactly. yeah, and you just see what works and what doesn't and just do what works. And, and if you're having fun, then I guess yeah. you're exactly. winning. So yeah, yeah. Yeah. winning. It's cool. Win. Absolutely winning. Yeah, I think – you guys, it looks like you're fucking having a great time. Yeah, yeah we do. We do. Yeah. Definitely when we're doing public. <laughs> Shaming, but how'd so you come the, up with the Instagram name? Uh, in a 
in that same Airbnb that <laughs> got us our ideas. Uh-huh. But yeah, we're in there and we're just like, we're yeah, thinking obviously about, yeah. unemployed and we'll spend so much money on like the worst Airbnbs and we're like, it was so expensive, the French Alps. Like we're paying like $30 for a burger that was shit and like $20 a beer. I'm like, oh my God, this sucks. <laughs> so we're unemployed, like really feeling like we're uh-huh. unemployed because money was just draining out. But then we were inspired but to we, do something. We were like thinking about jacket. Nah, it was a bit like, nah, it's boring. And then Stez and Fox, which is our nicknames. And I don't know. We're kind of Googling. <laughs> is it synonyms? Like, I don't know. For, the, for just like people that are, I don't know. We're just it's Googling. It's a funny name, man. Eh? I don't even play, but yeah, it, but it works. Hits. We're like, yep, that's it. Done. We made Let's the account it. and you made some bad videos at the start. And it's working. <laughs> and it's working. Mm. Learn from our mistakes. But no. Yeah, I love the, um, so you guys like so j- almost a year. Yeah. And I, I love the perspective of we've, be, we've been given it a crack for almost a year. Yeah. When some people might have it quicker than a year. Yeah. Mm. But, but some people take three years. or ten yeah. years yeah. before mm. it fucking works. Yeah. So, so annoying if it, if it was the tenth year where we popped. <laughs> and like, and we're then done. We'd have to, yeah, we're, yeah. Like, yeah. we're yeah. done. Like, this is the final, last month. <laughs> oh. That shit yeah. happens. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, maybe. It's yeah. like, you know, people die and then they become famous. Yeah, mm. artists. Yeah. Actually, does that happen? Yeah. Artists, artists definitely for artists. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Well, if they become bigger than they were when they were dead. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, that's why. Um, yeah, well, they normally do. Like, the yeah. sales go through the roof and yeah. the numbers on Spotify or whatever, mm. what do you call it? They didn't get to see the TV greatness. shows. Mm-hmm. That's why it's always interesting. Like, you think about the psychology of going to your own funeral. Yeah. Yeah, hey, yeah, just yeah. to sort of see yeah. everyone being nice and crying. Yeah, everyone's, yeah, yeah. everyone's thought You're about good. that. Yeah, yeah. 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 Who's going always, to would be there? Who would sing for me? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They always say, no, nah, guys, I want it to be a celebration. Oh, fuck no, I want everyone yeah, yeah, crying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I want everyone in tears. Yeah, not a dry yeah. eye. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks for coming on the show, guys. No, no you, bloody seriously. problem. I was just getting warmed up. Yeah, yeah. that's where you're going. <laughs> Two hours now. Yeah. No, that's the thing, right? So no, no, six no, minutes, no. how do you... Wait, how do you fight up in the six minutes of being on live television? That's this format is great because yeah, yeah. you're and on a tennis court that helps. Yeah, yeah, yeah it this does. Is, there's so much more relaxing oh. podcasts. It's just, like, just natural. You got time, and there you're trying to like I yeah. don't know your head's blowing and, up. And yeah. yeah, and I but, feel like you guys could actually care. You know, you're interviewing us because you probably want to know. Yeah. Whereas they might have got told to interview us. Where it's just <laughs> yeah. like, yeah, yeah. They definitely got told to interview <laughs> yeah. us. And Carl, then, Carl's son yeah. or something knows yeah, who yeah, you guys yeah. are. Yeah. And then. The crash, I don't know, it's just not as authentic. But that, they were, they were super. They were, it was amazing. Were it was great. such a good talk. Yeah. And they, yeah. they were for often like, the, the, what's his name, Alex? He was getting photos, he getting us to send videos to his wife and stuff, yeah. which yeah. is pretty cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Well, they're working with the structuring confounds. Mm. So that's why yeah. this show, we want you back on when you're back in Melbourne. Yeah, Every time you're down here, if you're down. For sure. Every 24 years when you visit yeah. Melbourne. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just pop in yeah. and, and we'll do the show. The, the, the daily talk show. The daily. Unreal. It's do, nice in here. Do you, uh, it's good it's air cozy. con as well, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Right. Bloody hell. Stay for another week. So <laughs> yeah. 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 Why don't we pull up on it? <laughs> yeah. I'll the floor. Yeah. Do you couch surf? Get the um, swag out. Yeah. We do in Sydney a bit because we don't have a place. We either sleep in our van or couch surf at a friend's yeah. place or yeah, whatever we can. The back of the van. Mm. Goes and right. Keeping and overheads low. Trying that's the, it's the key, that isn't it? That is the key when you don't have much money. What sort of van is it? To Hyundai Iload. Is that, oh, that yeah. in one yeah. of your videos? You, in yes. the Byron one? Yeah. 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 We're thinking yeah. that would be a good um, d- uh, Hyundai. Uh, I never know how to say it. Hyundai. I don't know. Hyundai. 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 Uh, Hyundai. Hyundai. follows oh. us on Instagram. Yeah. I'd like to get a, I don't know if this is too obnoxious, but I'd like the daily talk show, like a rap mm. on a van. Yeah. We have a garage here, could live here. Yeah. And it's our work, yeah. work, work. But then uh, we'll do horse. like shows. Yeah. Obnoxious? Yeah. Is it obnoxious? No, not at all. That's fine. Yeah. That's cool. Have you ever um, thought about putting a decal on your van? <laughs> yeah. With your faces yeah. or whatever? Just like mm. a little bit of like leaning as if you're a breakfast show. Yeah, you turn on us, it is a little bit obnoxious, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> just, just picture that. Yeah. Driving around your, with your own car. Yeah, no. Not doing <laughs> Shoot that. our faces on it. Follow us on Instagram. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That could be good. Please. Yeah. What about if you were to get like a sponsor to pay for the, uh, for the wrap? So say, you know, I just had know. a brand on the Still corner. Still couldn't do it. Yeah. Especially no, if you, no, to be honest, if you sleep, it. it's harder when you're sleeping in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? You get out of your, you get the coffee store at the local, you get out of your car and it's just the inspired unemployed. No, I'm not doing that. Cringing. No, Has it got a bed in the back? <laughs> it does. It does. It does. Yeah. It does. It's a few nights in that. A few nights, few, um, few cold. Nights. Yeah. What's the lead? What's the, I can't, we don't have to talk about it. Like well, around Byron, they hate it. 
what uh, sleepy unless you're in oh car yeah park, so it's like yeah in, it's, in Sydney it's pretty fine it's good with that car because no one knows it's a camper yeah, it's sure. just like an average van yeah. sus, sus van yeah. be yeah. no one's ever tried to break sus. into the yeah. van or anything while you're sleeping in there no yeah, it's okay. actually happened to me in um oh in in what's that place called in under LA um where we where we stayed in the Hollywood? Airbnb after oh, San, San, Diego. San Diego San Diego San Diego I stayed there with my mate but in the back of my van with my ex-girlfriend for a few nights and I had this at about three in the morning because it's, it's a party place this big old roided up cloud looking dude <laughs> like I was walking was, what's that it's a cloud <laughs> like a cloud cloud, like just a cloud, cloud, cloud looking place. dude yeah sure just yeah my puffy. pronunciation is it, not good no no yeah. no that's great no because <laughs> I'm very uh Receptive to new words, oh, and yeah, so yeah. when I think that it's a new word, I get excited. Sydney talk, yeah, yeah. Sydney talk. Yeah, this yeah. is good. Yeah. Oh, oh, he was walking down the road with about three mates. Mm. They were massive, like huge. He could hear him. They were bashing on all the cars, and I was like, "Oh fuck, here we go." <laughs> I had to protect my ex girlfriend, which I was not one to protect anyone. Still, still, am not. And um, got to got to my van, and he's trying to. He's like, he and his mates are trying to open every single door handle, like smash on the windows and shit. Oh, oh, it was so scary. I woke up and I was Lucky just like, locked the doors. don't Holy say shit. a word. <laughs> like, I was like, do not move. And he was looking in the windows and he's just like trying to open <laughs> every <laughs> door handle. Move. I was what shit. What do you think they myself. wanted? Because you think if they screamed, you, they probably would have like a <laughs> full high pitched scream. Like, yeah. But if yeah. they're banging yeah. it, are oh, they, they were, trying to smash the window? Oh, yeah, he was, they were angry. He was. Oh, so they were just angry. angry. He was yeah. roid rage in that place. Hey. Oh, no, that would be scary. Just putting on the brave face. Don't. That's all right. I got you. I got your love. Yeah. When he walks 100 meters down the road, he's like, "He's still there. I'll go yeah, bash yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's gone. I had gone. him. Just gonna flash the headlights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come back. I had him. Uh, yeah. Great boys. Right. Still here. Right. Thanks Thank so you. much. Thank you. Thanks, bro. Oh, yeah, we can shake hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. That's that first shake hands on the podcast. Have we done ones before? Yeah, yeah. 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 He does have rough hands, doesn't he? How soft are mine though? You're yeah, they're nice. Have you seen my toe off? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen what actually. the hell? Yeah, I got a friend that's what? got one like that. Why? Why? What a, you, a hacksaw or something? Murderer <laughs> stuff. <laughs> that's funny, hey. What I don't the know. Why did he. So he's got his own Instagram account. <laughs> Does he? Uh, no way. Yeah, if you could tag him. Und- uh, Can underscore I take a photo? toe thumb. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you want to be a selfie? Best Do you want to be in it? Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. Hold it up, Rival. It's hard. Okay, literally, it doesn't have. Oh my God. <laughs> so, what uh, the hell? Right. That's so amazing. Talk show. Uh, if you enjoyed the, sh- the show, leave us a, a review on Apple Podcasts. Uh, otherwise, see you tomorrow, guys. Like, comment, share, subscribe. <laughs> That's good. That's <laughs> a good call to action. Love it. Do it all. Thanks, more content. Bye. See ya. Bye bye.